Hello, Fat Fans. Welcome to BBC Word. Light heavyweight prospect Joshua Boatsi has stopped Liam Conroy in a third round. Wait. A flurry, flurry combination left hook, right hand uppercut turn at the same time. I mean, this guy is just special. Too special, too special, I must say. Too special. Even, you know, Carl Froch, you know, gave him, you know, props and is giving, still giving him props right now. Wow, wow, wow. That upper right hand was so good. It dropped Conroy so bad, and Conroy like <laughs> Conroy faced out like, what is going on? <laughs> oh my God, man! Ooh, ooh, Joshua Botsy is a is a, is a weapon to be reckoned with. I told you, this guy is something special. It's something special, something special. You know, what we've been hearing about this guy, you know, the hype around him is legit. And his humbleness, you know, his, you know, professionalism and the way he conducts himself is very, very, very good, very good as well. Uh, you know, no wonder he's been managed by Anthony Joshua, signed by Anthony Joshua. Interesting, interesting. Still undefeated. British light heavyweight champion from Croydon, Joshua Buatsi. Well, that was a good win, guys. That was a good win. I'm, I'm, I know I'm impressed by Buatsi. You know, he does everything right. We all know Liam Conroy is not the best of the best yet, but he's a guy that you know, has a lot of experience compared to Box and the boss is just went in there and does the job. Congress to Boatsy and as well congress to Liam Conroy for putting up a very good fight, but Boatsy showed the class, you know showed the the hunger and showed that he's really ready, you know, to shake up the light everweight division. What's he now doing damage? And he now has 10 fights, 8 knockouts. Congress to what's very, very nice. His dad is there. Look at his dad. <laughs> oh, man. Let's hear what he's got to say. Let's hear what he's got to say. Yeah, you have to thank God, bro. Definitely. Ten wins now. Ten wins. Zero loss. Brought me to this country. Most importantly, he brought me to this country. Brought me to the land of opportunity. Um, I feel honored. I feel humbled to win this belt, man. And again, the support from everyone. I didn't expect it, but I'm humbled by it. Thank you very much. What was your take on the fight itself? Um, first of all, I want to congratulate Conrad. He stepped up. Vacant title. He, he earned the shot. He took the fight. He came in. He tried. He caught me. Um, I just said to him, listen, man, it was my time. No hard feelings. I wish you, your missus, your newly born kid. I hope you get back home safely. I'm grateful for this. I don't think we've seen you. Well, that's a, cl- that, that's a class act from a uh, boss. It just seems to spur you into action almost. Yeah, Andy, if it's raining and you go outside, you're going to get wet. Uh, my trainer's not going to like that, but you get wet. You get hit a bit, but get, get them back. Like I said, get them before they get you. You're 10 and 0 now, perfect 10. Uh, feels just like a, such a rounded number to ask how you're finding the pro game so far. I know you say that it's really down to your coaches and their assessment, but how do you feel that you've adjusted the progress you've made so far? 
still a long way to go, but um, like I said, I'm grateful. The promoter, the managers, the trainers, they make the decisions, they guide the career. My job is to get ready to step in. Again, I'm grateful for the opportunity, man. Eddie, I want to thank you as well. You're guiding the career, man. They boo you, but listen, you're doing what you got to do. Do you know what I mean? And I'm grateful for the support, man. Eddie might have news. I'll bring him in to this interview. There was rumours... Well, I'm going to stop it there, right there. <laughs> but it's just to... Just too you know too good you know as a guy that has got lots and lots of class and you know and i think it's gonna go far and by the way uh, light of division is getting very good you know you've got anthony yard you know um Sergei kovalev as well and uh anthony yard might be fighting you know Sergei kovalev i don't know if they might fight i don't know i heard about you know the fight, uh, you know, might happen, but I don't know yet. Uh, let's just see if Yard can step up, but you never know. Um, but see, is a guy who's gonna go far and who's gonna, as a guy who's gonna dominate, in my opinion. He's very gentle, very humble, very you know, likable. You know, I, I like this guy, I like him, I like him. Hopefully, he goes far. Those are my thoughts for now, guys. Uh, give it a toss below, uh, like the video, share. And please don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And go follow me on Instagram at Boxing Block Center. And as well on Twitter at Boxing Block. Cheers everyone.